Do you ever feel like your child is trying to make you crazy on purpose? I've definitely felt like that with Monica. Come on, Monica, it's time for bed. I do my best to stay calm, but then she pushes. It's time to... And pushes. Monica, I'm getting really cross now. Until I crack. Ah! Then, to make matters worse, I blame her for pushing my buttons. It's your fault, Monica. You made me angry. Everyone's got buttons. They're just a part of who we are. The thing is, is that when something triggers my buttons, I can't think straight and stay calm when Monica and me get into an argument. So it's good to get to know what your buttons are, because then you can manage them and not let them take over when you're having a difficult time with your child. It helps me to keep that in mind, especially during the morning rush. Come on, Monica, we have to go to school. I mean it, Monica. Put your coat on now. If you don't put your coat on right now, I'll... (sighs) Okay, time to stop and think. You see, right there, my I need to be in control button has taken over. And I'm not listening to what Monica is really saying. She needs me to be the calm grown-up right now. Okay, Monica, it seems like you don't want your coat because maybe you're not cold. We can start walking to school and when you get cold, you can put your coat on. I wish I could say that I never let my buttons get the better of me, but they still do from time to time. And then I apologise as quickly as possible and make sure she knows that me shouting is not her fault. It's just me not managing my buttons.